Peace and Leapers, this is Super Zombie God Barbecue, and today we are going to get ourselves a pro gobble gobble gobbledy gooker. It is going to happen today, because we've got the fusion running, it's got two hours left, but we'll come back to it in a second because we've got to talk about ring domination, and on top of that, we got ourselves our f well, I don't count the Miz as my first pull, I got myself my first shattered pull, which is awesome, got some TBG awards to do, so we've got a lot to do today. So if you've actually got yourself a pool, because not many people have got themselves pools recently, I want you to let me know what it is in the comment section below. Whether it was Seth Rollins or Bo Dallas or whether it was... J oh, I can't say his name now. Okay, fine. And leave a like on this video if you like what you see. Subscribe to the channel as well and turn your notifications on. We are now on to our sixth card in bring domination six cards and during the last card which was edge on a WrestleMania 33 which no 34 not 33 34 tier we second or third shard in after about 250 resets and a reset is every time you get yourself either a shard and ring domination or the board resets and then you get like an, an ultimate or, I don't know, WrestleMania, then that is a reset. Not many people have been getting pulls recently, but that's another matter to discuss another time. Uh, but we have got ourselves our first Shatter pull. Now, unfortunately, I was out. I didn't get a live reaction. I managed to grab a screenshot literally as I pulled it. But after 250 plus resets, we got ourselves... A Kyle O'Reilly and I've got the footage right here to show you it is a single he's okay I mean he's better than some of the other cards I've got uh, he's better than the bar and he's better than Rusev so I can take that as a single but I am definitely looking for a pro at the moment and I could definitely do with one but it's seemingly the only way to get yourself shatter pulls at the moment is either in the events or alternatively by getting packs or just getting extremely lucky. Maybe if you bought loads of packs going to Shattered, Tier and King of the Ring. It's very, very strange at the moment and not lots of people are pleased. But for now, I'm happy because I'm going to grab myself hopefully another Shatter card before the end of this Ring Domination. Because I'm going to do this one, the, rest the Summer Sam 18 and then the Titan and the Monster. And that should get me in, I'd say, should be about there. To get yourself another shatter pull by the end. So Kyle O'Reilly was my shatter pull. If you got yourself a neon gothic summer some 18 gothic card. Like I said earlier on. Let me know in the comments section below your most recent pull. But us. We must move on from talking about pulls. To Team Battleground Awards. Because Team Battleground ended only like 20 minutes ago. We've swapped teams. We're now going over to the next set of Team Battleground. And we've got ourselves some awards to get. It was a really easy game. We didn't even have to play. 1,000 points against this team called Death Warrior. The new team we're up against is Goliath++. Plus Plus, So likely it is we're probably going to get the win there. But can I make it back-to-back -back Shattered cards in Team Battleground? All signs say no because it's never happened before. <laughs> and it hasn't happened for me in TBG for a long time. In fact, I think it was the beginning of Summer Sam 18 tier. I got like back to backs, but it hasn't happened for a while. Let's see if we can make it happen this time. Pad and pack, let's open it up. Boom! Uh, no, we can't make it happen, but Bray Wyatt's a pro. I just gotta hope the neon cards in here are either females or like Seth Rollins or something. Let's get our battleground points. I'm going to pro Bray. Let's open the next one. We've got a Bobby Lashley. That is a pro. And he's a left arrow. So that's good. And next one. Roderick Strong, which is also a pro. So two pros to add to the catalog. Bobby Lashley is really going to be the only useful one. Roderick Strong is probably going to be a silver star. Sorry, it, it's going to happen. But we'll have to wait till the next time to see if we can get ourselves another shattered card. Because... I'm guessing the pull rate for those is going to be very, very, very small. Although two people per team battleground at the moment are getting shattered cards. But for now, I'm going to segue and we're going to go to the fusion chamber. We have got two hours to go to get ourselves this gobbledygooker. 
And I don't know why I'm excited. He is the best in Gothic tier. So if you've got a pro of him and you're in Gothic tier, then this is awesome. This is just, just beyond awesome. But we do have to say that if you're going towards Neon, Shattered tier, it's not really going to be useful for you. It's more of a, you know, a nice little benefit. It's going to help you a little bit. We're going to move on. Actually, I think we've got some new rewards for the CP store. Yes, we do. Actually, he's got Leo Rush. So they've not offered new cards yet. And we've got Ricochets here. That's pretty cool. They've done a Ricochet card back. And I might get that. I'm not sure. I like it, but do I like it more than the others? Hey, at the end of the day, the CP cards for Gothic tier, they're still good. So if you've been playing the game for a while, if you've got lots of CP, you can get yourself Leo Rush twice. You got yourself Buddy Murphy twice. And you get yourself the Gobbity Gooka. You've basically got three Gothic pros before you've done anything. I think that's quite good. You know, I think that's quite good. So we got ourselves Leo Rush there. I think with the Team Battleground stuff, I don't think they've changed anything. Yeah, looking at the store, I can't see they've changed anything on here. They've not added anything to it. I don't think they've added anything to any anything else, to be honest with you. But it means I'm going to get on with some ring domination. We're going to get ourselves a gobbledygooker very, very soon. And honestly, I'm quite excited for it. So, segue. So here we are right now. Gobbledygooker pro time. We're going to grab ourselves that second gooker from the fusion chamber. If you've got gooker yourself, I mentioned any polls comments below let's grab it second gobbledy gooka hype i wonder when the normal fusion is going to come out but there we go let's get him proed up i'm not going to token him or level him up in any way shape or form because he doesn't really benefit me but i'm going to keep him in the deck because why not let's lock in Roderick strong and we're actually going to level up bray white now and i'm just going to say this now if you're in gothic tier or below then please 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 look away now because otherwise you're going to be very triggered. So let's combine. We're going to level up. And it gives me a brand new card in the catalog as well. 72, 75. Uh, let's go Daniel Bryan and Asuka. That should be enough to get to 75. Perfect. So actually, let's token him now. I'm going to go speed, charisma, and... No, I'm actually going to go in the proc because I might end up using this as like an underleveled card for something. So we'll go for that. There is Gobbledygooker. I've kept Seth because Seth's image just looks fantastic on it. Let's go Gobbledygooker. We're going to do the, the... People are going to be so angry I'm doing this, but whatever. Uh, that should be 75, 75. Nice one. Let's go Speed, Charisma, and Proc again. And we're going to combine them. Uh, let's go to the other Gobbledygooker. Combine. Gobbledygooker Pro. Boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. It is done. And it looks glorious. Absolutely glorious. Let's change it over to the, the Titan image. Ooh, I don't know which one to have. I think I have to go for the Titan one because it was the event card. And it was the first event card of season four as well. Not many people got the pro. So I found a spare neon card I can get rid of. So there we go. He is who I loved up. 50 of 50 speed, charisma, and then proc. I think he's going to be better than Seth Rollins. Yeah, there we go. He's better, much better than Seth Rollins. Does he? He is actually the best card in the tier. So if you got him, he's the best person to have. And he just so happens to tag with Buddy Murphy as well. What a result if you got yourself the uh, card from the CP store. So that is the gobbledy gobbledy gooka. I am done for today. Thank you guys so much. I'm going to get on and finish off the rest of Ring Domination. Like this video as hard as you possibly can. Subscribe to the channel by... No, if you're a gobbledy gooka... Peck the, 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 I don't even know what I'm saying. Peck the subscribe button as hard as you possibly can and turn notifications on. Until next time though, I've been Super Zombie Guard Barbecue. You have been awesome. And one last thing, and that is two. Three.